I was truly excited to receive the letter saying that I was elected as a Fellow of the Royal Society. Uh, deeply honoured as well. And it's really quite a humbling experience to look at the list of former members, former Fellows of the Royal Society, uh, Newton, Einstein, Rutherford, Charles Darwin, people who you know, I can only hope to sweep up the crumbs of their scientific table. Uh, and, and I also think it's, it's a great honour for the people who worked with me, uh, the graduate students, 40 or so graduate students over 30 years, the, the postdocs, the, and even the technicians who really played an important role in our developing our experimental research. This is truly blue skies research in many ways. Uh, and you know, sometimes I liken our research to, to Scott of the Antarctic or Hillary and Tenzin climbing, climbing Everest. Uh, we, we are really exploring a new regime for chemistry to happen, but I believe that that is research that matters because it's, it's, it can really transform our understanding of the way chemistry happens at a microscopic level. We have a, a small number of Fellows of the Royal Society here at Birmingham and I'm very happy to be adding to that number. I know that the university regards this as something very prestigious and, and an honour for the university and I'm glad uh, to be able to add to that number.